Hey, what's up guys? We are here in the Whipple. It needs some gas. I uh, didn't really have a lot of time to plan on getting this thing stored for the winter. Um, my original plan of just getting a trickle charger for it. I figured I'd rather have the engine running, get some uh, lubrication going through it. And uh, so that's what I did. She's dirty. She's under the carport. She's getting a lot of dust on her. Today is a cold day. It is very cold, but it rained the last two days, so there's not, there's no salt on the road or any brine or anything like that. So we should be pretty good. Uh, I just want to get her to the gas station, uh, let her warm up a little bit, and get some fuel in her. Um, that should make it through the rest of the winter. I've got some big things planned for the channel. If you guys didn't know from watching my videos last year, I will link them in the video right now. I will start putting all the links up to those videos right now. But I'm going to have this Mustang, the 800 horsepower Whipple, at Motorama. Motorama is a big uh, car enthusiast, truck show. Uh, they do motocross, autocross. They do this uh, uh, RC, like demo derby. They do RC uh, races. It's really neat um, to watch those cars. I'm going to put all those videos in the video right now clickable links in the description below so you can see all my previous videos from motorama but 2020 this 800 whip uh 800 horsepower whipple mustang gt will be featured in motorama and i will be at motorama for all of you to meet shake my hand come up take a picture with me uh let's talk cars i'd love to talk cars with all of you i'm going to be walking around filming as well and uh we're going to get it done I hope you guys uh, like this car. Uh, like I said, it'll be available for you to see in person. And let's get this car. Let's get her out and about. Let her stretch her legs a little bit. It's so weird driving this uh, this car versus the Explorer Sport or the Ram. It's a lot of horsepower. Even though the Ram that I'm driving now has a lot of torque and a lot of horsepower itself, this is a different kind of horsepower. People don't understand. Yeah. See, so yeah, I was starting her, letting her run for 15 minutes every couple of days getting her warmed up, charging the battery, and uh, eventually got to the point where I needed gas. So here I am, taking her to the gas station. I miss this thing. This thing rips. So uh, I'd like to see all of you guys. Come uh, down to Harrisburg, to the Farm Show Complex, to Motorama. I will include a link to Motorama so you guys can uh, see all the uh, events that are going to take place over the two days. There's a lot of stuff to do. Uh, they have food vendors. Uh, there's tons of vehicles to see. You could literally spend all day there. It is a friendly atmosphere for the family. I made so much uh, footage. I got so much footage last year. There's a ton of stuff to see and do there. <clears throat> I really enjoyed myself last year. So check it out. Now if it snows, I'll have to find somebody to take this car down there on a trailer because I can't drive this thing in the snow. Um, so if any of you are close to Northeast PA and have a uh, have a car trailer and would like to assist me in that I would love I would love for uh, you guys to help me out uh, other than that I'm probably just gonna be asking a buddy or two uh, if I can use their their car trailer and uh, we'll get it down there so I'm gonna fill up and uh, I'll see you when I'm done you know I was just gonna uh, 
take her out, get her some fuel. And uh, then take her back to the house. But I love driving this car. So I'm gonna take her for a little rip, get her some, uh, get her some breathing room, let her stretch her legs, and uh, we'll go from there. this thing has oh in the time the time my vehicle takes to get 40 or 50 mile an hour this thing's doing 90 to 100 it's insane shout out to coyote car guy uh he set the bar he took his car to the track stage one wibble 2018 and uh his best time was a 10.6 so i'm gonna be uh i'm gonna be taking mine to the track this year with a set of stickies and uh, doing it right Josh from the 570 Experience.